10 bubble teas. I'm at Creation and I'll be getting my shots. So we're heading to Ikea. We've been here for like two days now. Okay, we have a problem. Well, I'm making a vlog. <laughs> This is not scary. I don't know what is. All right. Oh wow. Mm. Oh no. It's hard when you're chasing your dreams, your success, and all these things. But staying grounded is another thing. It's I'll be I'm making a very healthy burger for today. Hi guys, so let me help you understand further on how to watch the readings. So remember, this is going to be based on Vedic sidereal astrology, not Western. So if you're watching this from your sun sign, then the resonance of the energy will be happening on a soul level. Now, if you are watching this from your ascendant, then from ascendant, it's happening towards the physical manifestation of the reading. And then, if you are watching this on your moon sign, then this is going to be resonating from your feelings, your mind, and your thoughts. Now, for the people who are looking for that masculine energy, then you would have to look for Jupiter in your chart so that you will know how the energy works. And then, if for the people who are attracted to the feminine energy, then you would have to look for Venus. Now, do remember that Venus also rules the energy of the relationship, so that would be also helpful for you. Now that you guys are all set, thank you very much, and let's begin with your reading. Hi, Scorpios. Hola. Buenas noche. How are you? I'm excited. I'm always excited. I got coffee, guys. I got coffee. We lit. We good. So this is your bonus as always. The bonus, basically how it works, I'll explain to all the Zodiac once I'm done with all. It's just like who, like, you know, it's like there's, if there's a lot of feedback, then we, I just keep reading those Zodiac. So meaning it's like, okay, then I'll continue guiding. Um, so make sure you're just co always commenting and then just clicking like, so that when, when cause they just tell me, it's like, okay, so there's people, there's a lot of people wanting, you know, this, this and that, and I just read it, okay? So make sure you're just always commenting so that I, you, you know, it's like I make the bonuses. Because if nobody's gonna, you know, say, like you, you catch my drift, okay? <laughs> so just keep commenting and liking so I know that you guys need a read, okay? Not like the Aries. <laughs> Shh. They're Mars also. Shh. Okay. <laughs> so, um, these are bonus. Uh, we're gonna go for the Oracle, uh, Oracle cards, okay? Um, different. I'm not... I may show this oracle card. I may not show it just because it's a little bit dark. Okay. <laughs> just like the coffee in your love life. Okay. <laughs> I'll get the zodiac for the extended. Make sure you're checking out whichever side it is here for your um, late night tarot. Okay. Tarot after the dark. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Uh, let's go here. Let's, go. let's see the oracle. Oh, let's see here. We good, corpse. We good. Oh, last reading. Did you guys see it? It was crazy. You guys are unstoppable. Okay. You're probably, you know, it's like, you know, if your frequency is raising like a Scorpio, the, the nice kind of Scorpio. Okay. <laughs> That's good. Okay. Keep raising up the vibration. All Zodiac has different kinds of frequencies. So. Okay. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. I'll show it. I'll show it. Okay. I'll show it. It's a winter throne. Okay. Um, I feel here like you're protected. Okay. You're protected by different uh, spirit guides. Very, very well protected. Okay. <laughs> um, watch also the, the tarot after the late night because um, it was the, about the Frost Queen. Um, and someone came after the Frost Queen. So this can be you. Like, you've done mm, not just major changes. 
it's about you finally like you know kind of seeing your value the truth inside you like who you really are and you have some you know so you have some i feel like angel fairies over there around you you have some you have everybody here you have the fox you have the, you know you have the crow it's almost like you're you're crossing how to say this you're crossing what is in the middle of the good and the bad okay so spirit way. okay this is spirit way. okay that's what i said okay. so that's my spirit card okay let's go here okay. so spiritually you, you are accepting the good and the bad the yin and yang and you're very much well protected from anything that's good <laughs> you got a new life Mm, that's so cool. See, I told you, it's like you're you're really, really there right now. Your existence brings purpose. This is what they're saying. Oh, existence that brings purpose. Hello, healer. Hello, someone who wants to do good for other people. Number thirty-nine. Okay, you're coming out. You're you're basically being reborn right now. Uh huh. That's good. Let's go for the tarot. Embrace that new that new energy around you. Okay. Let's see. Oh, if you need any personals, um, if there's something available, there's gonna be in the description box, just right there. Make sure you also follow the vlog. I forgot. Oh my god, there's so much things I forgot because I don't have my crew. Uh, there's a giveaway also in the other channel. Okay, so make sure you follow it. Prince of Swords. Okay, so. Someone wants to either conquer you or victim you. There's two ways. Either this person is going to do something good or do something bad. We'll get, we're going to go through this. Uh -huh. um, I feel like it's good. Good news is coming with regards to whoever you're connecting with. It's almost like they're, they're tired. They're tired of something that they did to themselves. So meaning you're not even part of it. I uh, mean, uh, creating drama and chaos. They, they're tired of it. Can be younger person. Okay. Oh, so they're they're tired of stalking you. They're tired of just watching you. Um, they're tired of just seeing you from a distance. Um, and they want to. It's almost like they want to break the silence between the two of you because it's as if like you really, really have changed and detached yourself. Because it's it's just like for you, it's like I'm a new person now. And this new person they want to they want to talk to this new person, which is you. I know you're meeting someone new, can be. Mm hmm Let's see. Oh yeah. Five of swords, you see. They're tired. They they want to break the silence because what happened was you guys had a breakup. No communication after that. They they thought. Let me get some coffee up here because we're gonna go deeper. They thought. They thought that they won. They won nothing because after that, after what happened, um, you just shed your skin. So you did your whole, you know, stereotypical Scorpio where I'll just change everything in my life and you know I'll I'll just move forward. So you keep this is you're not here, Scorpio. This is that person only. Vice versa for a cross watcher. Now this person, by the way, um, they're claiming that you cheated on their connection. Just saying, you're gonna be accused by this person that like you were not acting for the best interests of the romantic connection. And now they wanna offer you this Ace of Coins. Mm -hmm. so wanting to reach out and because they see that you are just you're just a new person over here I, I'm telling you you can be meeting a new person also but whoever you had a falling apart okay they're basically coming to you and giving you this offer now ace of coin is ace of coins is about oh let's date each other Let's see where it goes, how far, and you know, it's like, but this is about a renewal of uh, 
someone wants to renew faith in the connection. But I see here that you really don't give and you don't care. There is no feelings for you anymore. You're detached. <laughs> you close a chapter. Chapter. <laughs> Paki like, paki share. Pautan. <laughs> Pag sweldo. <laughs> so you close a chapter of your life and then, you know, doors are opening with a world card. Can be a long distance relationship that you have lost interest. Mm hmm. Because you're not here. And every time I see that the Scorpio is not here, it means they're dating. Oh, sorry, cross-watcher. Sorry, it may be triggering, but it is true. But you can be dating. You can be dating, you know. There's a lot of people out there. Mm -hmm. This new life, which is the world card. Okay, you went to something karmic. Okay, because for you, Saturn to be here, <laughs> you got basically B-I-T-C-H slapped by Saturn until you wake up. So you're woke now. Okay. Um, you're gonna try to escape this connection. You get a seven of swords. Okay, because for you, it's just like, okay, well, if you're gonna claim that I, you know, basically like you were the one who caused the problem, okay, then I caused the problem, but then I'm going. So you're gonna accept defeat by, when you accept it, you basically become a winner because this person now has nothing to use against you oh okay so i'm wrong okay i'm wrong okay all right all right okay i'm wrong and then i'm gone okay so you're doing it in a scorpio way also <laughs> like you sting it at the least part oh okay so i was a cheater okay all right then okay then we'll call it a day okay so i was the one betrayed okay so now this person hurts their ego because you're just accepting whatever they're throwing at you. So they can't. So you're disarming what they're trying to put onto you, like a burden even. Mm -hmm. Like you were, you had the whole fault. Oh, okay. So I cause it, and then that's for you. Mm -hmm. The seven of swords. Like that's a sneaky way of ending a connection. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, Prince of Pentacles. And the moment that you do this, they retract. Here, what do you want from me? Oh, so it's the push and pull. It's the push and pull right now. What do you want from me? Let me offer it to you. Okay, but you're like, eh, nah, I'm not interested in that. No, no, no. You, you offer it to me now, but when, you know, it's like, but you, when you were there, <laughs> you were not getting any offer. So you have someone who has changed their mind after you've changed your mind. Mm -hmm. So let's see where this goes. You could be connecting with a... Um, you know, long distance relationship acquires Taurus the Scorpios right here. Definitely a Taurus also. Okay. Because um, you have two Taurus cards. We'll see here. Okay. If you guys will cross the bridge and give this person a chance. Or you're totally, totally done with this. Link down there in the description box as you basically have a new beginning in life. You could be meeting someone new and we'll see the Ace of Pentacles also. But normally... Um, this apology that they're bringing to you, apology comes with a strong commitment. So they made up their mind, and you made up your mind. I don't think Scorpios ever change mind also, once they made up. Okay? So thank you very much guys for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful day, and I'll see you guys. Oh, sorry, I forgot the zodiacs. Sorry! Pasensha. Uyat. <laughs> yeah, Scorpio over here. You got the Capricorn for the Earth sign. Okay. You got Star card Aqua. And you got Emperor Aries. Okay. So we good. Okay. I'll see you on the other side. Bye. They did it. And now they have to fix it. Queen of Cups. I said Naga. Because that was a Leo Nakshatra. Cancer Leo. No. This person loves you a lot, very much. But they see you right now as someone who's just, the, you're the full card. You're having this new beginning in life. And I gotta stop. Let's see. Got a devil, Capricorn. It's H3 of Pentacles.